Welcome back, everyone. Award-winning and best-selling authors are coming to the Hardesty Regional Library next week for an event they're calling a casual evening of books, bards, and bites. Joining me this morning is uh, Jennifer Wells. She is the literacy coordinator for uh, the libraries here in town. She'll get into that in just a second. She's going to tell us a little bit more about this event, and along with her is one of those award-winning writers uh, that's going to be part of that event. Sasha Martin, welcome, ladies. Thank, Thank you. you for How are we doing us. this morning? You're quite welcome. Oh, well, very good. So we've got this big event that's coming, and it all goes to support uh, the libraries here in town. Why don't you tell us about what's uh, going on? Right. Um, well, we're doing our annual literacy fundraiser for the Ruth G. Hardman Adult Literacy Service, and it's called Chapters: An Evening of Books, Bards, and Bites. And it's just a great event where we have um, three authors, including Sasha this year, and we. Um, have lots of donated food from great restaurants around the county, um, like Yokozuma, Kyo, Mondo's, just all kinds of different stuff. And it's just an evening where you can walk around, listen to authors talk, have some, you know, really good food, have a glass of wine, and just, it's a really enjoyable thing. It's a lot of fun, and the money all, all goes to the Adult Literacy Program. Yeah, that's really nice. Tell us a little bit about the Adult Literacy Program itself and how that works. Well. Um, the library offers an adult literacy program that is totally free, um, and we work with students who either read, write, or speak English at a lower than sixth grade level to help them improve their skills to the point where they can get in. You know, at a seventh grade level, you can probably go on to an adult education program. So that's it's one-on-one -on -one tutoring. We're always looking for volunteer tutors, so I'll put that out there. But you know, it's just. Um, um, it's really one of the most rewarding jobs I've ever had, and it. So, <laughs> sure, I, I completely believe you. And you, you need some funds for this. And so, throwing an event like this, having a few authors in town that people can come and listen to, they can uh, ask them personal questions during this event. Sounds like it's a. Uh, it's really neat. Um, as far as joining the event, Sasha, you told me a little earlier when we spoke that you've attended this event before, but you've never been one of the speakers at the event before. Tell us about how this is going to change for you and what you're looking forward to. Well, one of my favorite parts of the event is that intimacy where you get to speak to the authors and learn more about what they're doing and, of course, supporting the literacy program. So for me, I'm just thrilled to get out there and, you know, share my story with Community. I'm a Tulsan and uh, always enjoy being a part of the library programming. Yeah. That's really nice. Tell us a little bit about your experiences as an author. You've been able to travel the world and write about that, right? Well, so I actually wanted to travel the world but had a little baby girl, so I ended up cooking a meal from every country in the world A to Z from my kitchen in Tulsa. Okay. And uh, National Geographic got wind of that and ended up writing my memoir with them. Um, and right away when I began working on that, they started asking, why? Why were you obsessively cooking the world? What was going on with you? This is not normal. And um, a lot of it, you know, had to do with my childhood. So the book explores that origin and how I grew up and what was making me search for this sense of belonging. Very nice. So you're excited to be here mm -hmm. in Tulsa and go to this event, be a part of it, be a speaker mm -hmm. instead of just a spectator. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Sounds like a really good time. Uh, anything else that we want people to know about the events? Tickets still available for this? Tickets still available, but they will be at the door only. So it's $50. Um, and again, you're welcome to purchase your tickets at the door. Um, you can find more information on our website, tulsalibrary.org, um, or at the Tulsa Library Trust website as well. Sounds like a great event for a great program. Yes. All right. Thanks for joining us this morning, ladies. We appreciate it. Thank you. Again, Chapters, a casual evening of books, bards, and bites happening Thursday, September 20th at 630 at the uh, Hardest, Hardesty Regional Library, 8316 East 93rd Street. You can dial 918-549-7494 for more information or visit TulsaLibrary.org. They're also